the Hebrew Israelites. We come out here week in and week out to prophesy the downfall of America and give you a message from the Most High Himself, man. All right, the message that we come forth with is not of our own hearts, it's of the Holy Scriptures, in which there has been a, a lot of lies, all right, told about the Bible. There's been a lot of witchcraft used along with this Bible. Therefore, a lot of our people don't believe in it anymore, man. But guess what? This is the true book, man. That's right. The so-called white man that brought us over here in, in cargo slave ships never taught us that we were the Israelites. All right? He never taught us that we were the true Jews. He never taught us to keep the law, statutes, and commandments of the Heavenly Father. All right? He never taught us anything that is true in this book. Instead, he used lies, all right? And from our people creating a false religion, he stole from Egypt, Babylon, and all of these other uh, different places and created this mess that you call Roman Catholicism, man. That's right. All right? But we're living in the times now where there's about to be a lot of things happening, man. The Most High is about to start letting things be known on the planet Earth through his men. That's right. All right? And the so-called white man is the devil according to the Bible, man. Let, let's, let's, let's not ever forget that, man. All That's right, right Akia. All right? All right, read that. Deuteronomy 33 and 29. Happy art thou, O Israel. Right, and, and we are happy right now, man. All right, this is a book of prophecies, histories, laws, statutes, and commandments according to the Israelites and the Israelites only, man. This is our history book, all right? So we should be happy, and the elect right now are happy because of the works of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh throughout the whole planet Earth, man. Go ahead. Who is like unto thee? Right, no nation is like unto the nation of Israel, sure. which consists of you so-called Negroes, all right, West Indians, Haitians, Latinos, Native Americans, Dominicans, all right, the people with flavor on the earth, man. That's right, brother. You're the true Israelites, man. And you've been bewitched, you've been hoodwinked by your enemy, the, the so-called white man, all right? That's right. He taught you you were African. He taught you everything but the truth of who you are, man. And That's now right. you walk around America simple as hell, man. That's right. Eating Hot Pockets. That's right. Losing, man. All right, go ahead, brother. Oh, people, saved by the Lord, the shield of thy help, and who is the sword of thy excellency. Right, he's the shield of our help. You got a lot of these niggas in the black consciousness movement saying there's no God. If there's no God, the whole nation of Israel will be destroyed, man. If there isn't no God to come deliver us out of this crazy situation we in, we're gonna be killed off, man. Our children are gonna be raised all right, amongst homosexuals and uh, a bunch of other demonic forces on the planet Earth. All right, the food by then will be destroyed. All right, so there's something of a higher power that has to come deliver people of color, man. So-called right people of color, because we're the Israelites. A higher power needs to come deliver us, man. Yet our people don't want to get out of this condition. They want to stay here, man. They want to stay in this condition and be stuck on stupid, man. That's right. Under the ugliest people on the planet Earth, the so-called white man. That's right. The most diabolical nation that has ever been created, man. That's right. You have to get out of the power seat, man. That's right, brother. That's right. Under your rule, everything is destroyed, man. Yep. All right? Yeah, Go ahead. You can't see that the so-called white man is the devil. You are spiritually retarded. Yeah, you out of That's your right. damn mind. All, you, all it takes is 30 minutes of watching CNN, and you can see who has caused the problems in Earth. That's right. It's clear and evident. Man, you watch TV. You just watch regular basketball game. The commercials, everything is just freaked out, man. Yep. This guy has lost his damn mind, man. Yep. All right? And then the Lord said in the scriptures that in the last days he would expose who the devil was, man. That's right. Go ahead. This is a... Uh, Second Ezra 4 and 29, if therefore that which it's like yak. Second Ezra 4 and 29, if therefore that which is sown be not turned upside down. Right, and that's that that which is sown is talking about wickedness, man. Alright? We in this condition because of what our forefather Adam did, man. Alright, which was prophesied and which had to happen. Go ahead. And if the place which but where the evil is so passed not away. Right, so evil, what we're living in America is basically the fulfillment of evil, the left-hand agenda. 
This is the last leg of wickedness ruling on the planet Earth, man. And after this, we're gonna set up a righteous kingdom through the most beautiful people on the planet Earth. That's right. All right, and usher out what? The law, statutes, and commandments of the Heavenly Father. Because when you try to build a society outside of that, nothing but chaos can follow, which is what you see before you, chaos, man. An un ungodly society is being built up before your eyes, man. That's right. And you see the fruits of it, man. Everything is horrible. That's right. Okay. This is Daniel, the seventh chapter, right. verse 26. Right. But the judgment shall, shall sit, and they shall take away his dominion to consume and to destroy it until the end. Right. And the kingdom and dominion and the greatness of the kingdom under the whole heaven right. shall be given to the people of the saints of the Most High. And the elites know about this scripture. The elites know this is the truth. They know that they're going down, man. But like the, like the brothers just brought out, we're going to establish a righteous kingdom. We're going to take the kingdom from you damn devils, man. That's right. Because you ain't got no business ruling the planet Earth, man. You know what? Let me start at 25. Okay. Uh, Daniel 7 and 25. And he shall speak great words against the most high. Right, and that great words is what? This devilish philosophy being pushed out on the planet Earth. Darwinism. All right, what else they got? Christianity. Christianity. Your, 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 your false capitalism. Right. All, all the, all your, your homosexuality doctrine. Right. Mediocracy. You know? Mediocracy. Your, your mean man mediocr mediocrity uh, doctrine. Where it's okay to be a numb nut. Yeah. All right. Do as thou wilt. That uh, that whole do as thou wilt philosophy. You know, from Aleister Crowley and all the other demonic, satanic, masonic leaders, elite that rule the, uh, the world. Right. All right. All those strongholds are going to be pulled down by the heavenly Father. Right. Okay. You can snicker and smile and giggle and do all the madness you want. But it's not going to stop the program that's happening on the earth. That's right. Okay? And a Heavenly Father is sending it for That's right. Go ahead. All right? It says, and he shall speak great words against the Most High. Right. Everything that he's speaking is to tell you that there is no God in so many words. And when people don't have fear of a higher power, man, there's no end to the wickedness that can follow, man. This society is being built on the foundation that there is no God. Therefore, you have people living complete, like, like complete beasts with no conscience or mind frame or, or, or remembrance of the wickedness that they're doing. They don't care. That's how children are being brought up, man. All right? Go ahead. And shall wear out the saints of the Most High. Right, and you wore out the saints of the Most High, man. And we're living testimony. We wore out, man, right. under your rule, man. You can't, every, every time you look, it's a damn check. They taking this out, they taking that out. Yeah. All right? An unlawful tax is, is, is one reason for your ass to be destroyed. Usury, all right? Everything that you're doing is wearing out the saints, man. Your food yep. is destroying people, yeah. all right? That's why everybody in the MMA, boxing, and football are injured. Because the food that they're eating isn't enough to sustain them like it was back in the day, man. Yep. Therefore, men are being turned into women and all under whose rule, man? The mad scientist himself, the so-called white man, who's the devil, man. The problem, all right, go ahead. The issue. <laughs> the issue. And think to change times right. and laws, uh -huh. and they shall be given into his hand. Right, and he has changed times, changed times and laws, man. All right, built a false calendar in which uh, our people love to uh, follow. Yep. All right. Everything about this man is backwards, man. Yeah, that's why that's why he has the new year in the middle of winter. Yeah. You know, because he's changed times and laws. All right. It says, until a times and times and a dividing of times. Right. Basically, we were given over into the hand of our enemies for a certain amount of time. And during this time, wickedness would, 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 would become the, the, the cool thing on the planet Earth, man. Yep. Yep. All right? Because you, they started to take us over from Spain and from the west coast of Africa in the, in the late 1500s and the 1600s, man. And at times and times in the... Uh, and, and half the time is talking about that 300, somewhere around 350 year span, all the way up until the 60s, man. 
when, when the knowledge of the scripture started to be unsealed, man. Yep, which we, yep, we'll get into that. Okay. Yep, that's right. That's right. That's true. And we're living in those times now, man. Go ahead. All right. So there's it's, no way you so-called white people can do what you have done and not expect some sort of payback, man. That's yeah. right. Go ahead. Right. And the kingdom and dominion and the greatness of the kingdom under the whole heaven shall be given to the people of the saints of the Most High, right. whose kingdom is an everlasting kingdom. Everlasting kingdom. The Most High was fair with you nations, man. He gave all of you blessings. He gave all of you dominion over the planet Earth. He gave you the children of Israel for an inheritance for a certain amount of time. You, your, your time is up, though, man. Right. It's time for the true people of the planet Earth, the true kings and princes of the planet Earth to rule, man. That's right. It's about that time, man, because if this keeps going, man, it's a, come on, man. God damn. Go ahead. It's too much, man. And all dominions shall serve and obey him. Right. So you go be under the rule of us, all right? Through the spirit of Yahweh Shimei Awashai, through the righteous laws, man. Right. All right. Uh, this is uh, Second Ezra 5 and 1. Nevertheless, as concerning the tokens, behold, the days shall come that they which dwell upon earth shall be taken in a great number. Right, and that's through death, because who's ruling? Like it says in Revelation 6, he set up on a red horse and what followed him? Death, man. So under his rule, people are just dying. Death is just a, every, that's like drinking water. Oh, that nigga died, okay. Oh, they got AIDS on, okay. You've been conditioned to accept death. You've been conditioned to accept, like the brother said, mediocrity, man. <laughs> All right? right. Health, health is foreign. Yeah. Knowledge is foreign. Being smart is foreign. Yeah. All right? That's right. Go ahead. Uh, and the way of truth shall be hidden. Right. And the land shall be barren of faith. Right. And that's what you see right now on the planet Earth, man. The way of truth is hidden. That's why people scoff or get uh, uncomfortable when you get serious. When you talk anything serious to a so-called Negro, what do they do? They get uncomfortable, man. All right, go ahead. But iniquity shall be increased. Right, iniquity is increased under your rule, man. That's why we out here crying to our power. That, that, that's why we out here, man. That's right. We've came to the conclusion that there is no hope for us in this society. So what better thing to do is come out on the highways and the byways and tell the world how the Lord feels, man. That's right. So that he can hasten the day and get us the hell out of here, man. That's right. That's what matters. Go ahead. Above that which now thou seest, or right. thou hast heard long ago. Right. Back then, the men, the men in this society, that if they would have lived right now, they would be going completely nuts, man. That's right. All right. Men with men being promoted. Now you had homosexuals, but that that was a, it was a, it wasn't a normal thing. It was looked at in a in a in a strange light. People looked at homosexuality back then as something bad. In this society, it's somehow cool, man. Yeah. When, you right. read, when you read in Second Ezra, Second Ezra was prophesied during the time of the Persian Empire. Now he was traveling through Babylon and was looking at all the madness that was going on. Man. So he was crying out to the Heavenly Father, like, "Man, what the hell, man? How are you uh, kicking our butt when you see what, what the heathens is doing? All this? How much more so is that in this society?" Wickedness is at an all-time high in this society. Okay? These people are completely gone, man. Yep, and that's what you see. Year after year, from the 80s till now. If you was born in the 80s or the early 90s, all right, and you have watched the planet Earth since that time, it has gotten completely worse. That's right. All right, go ahead. Verse 3, in the land that thou seest now to have root, shall thou see wasted suddenly. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. It's a lot in there. Go ahead. But if the Most High grant thee to live, thou shalt see after the third trumpet uh -huh. that the sun shall suddenly shine again in the night. Right. And what's, what is that? The, the way of truth will be known again on the planet Earth. All right. And that's, what, that's the time we're in now, man. The Most High is opening the truth back up, but he's doing it through something that the world hates. That's right. This message of this book was never created for the masses to accept, man. That's right. What you seeing right now is prophecy live in your face, man. All right, what is that? Get the comforter real quick. This is uh, St. John, 
14 and 26. Right. The comforter, right. which, is, which is the Holy Ghost. The Holy Spirit is the comforter, Imam Bashir. It's not Muhammad. All right? The Holy Spirit is the comforter. And you say it says he. Well, the scriptures call wisdom a sheep. Does that mean wisdom is some woman walking around or came on the planet Earth and created a, a, a religion? No, man. It's symbolic. And the comforter is the, the Yahawashi opening up the understanding from the right hand side through the men on the planet Earth that he that's chose right. to, man. Right. All right, and that, that's what you see happening through us, man. Lord willing, we're the ones chosen to endure, though. Go ahead. Holy Father would send right. in my name 